is more new stuff, man, right? So let's break it down by series because you have the AccuStrike series. Let's move on. Let's dip into the Super Soaker series that I just don't like. Mega series took a hit in 2017 because the negotiator, it's ugly, weird looking, and I just don't like it. And that's this bad boy over here that we mentioned earlier. Terra Blaster, not too bad at 17. And that's this bad boy over here. The real deal stuff. Let's get into the top five blasters and the red team. And now this is the white team. It's like the, I don't know if it's worth it. Because like I said, it's around $70. So when you compare $70 to $80 blaster here, I love you. Believe me. So, and so the key is just too big and too stupid, nerf. Anybody under 10 is going to have a hard time holding this. What happened there, dudes? Because it looks like a crossbow, but it shoots like a regular blaster. So yeah, guys, make sure you share your thoughts on all these five options that I just gave out in the comments. Focus on the new nerf blasters that came out in 2017. Those are the ones that were... Zombie Strike series had two blasters come out in 2017. And it seems like the Zombie Strike nerf rival balls, which is pretty bad nerf. So this blaster, you can kind of collapse it. And then, uh, let's get into the Mega Line, huh? Here we go. And, you have the nerf Mega. This season, you're in panic mode and you're stuck in a rut. You need to buy a nerf blaster. Better. Let's decide. So let me know in the comments. This nerf Nitro. Flash Fury, bad blaster in the Rival series. Thing is with this blaster, it's a pricey blaster. It's around $40. And if you want to see the full review on this rifle, click this link up here. And when we reach the season, one thing to get a lineup of 2017. Best thing of all, it doesn't take batteries. Best gift for 2017 Christmas season. Pricey? Yes, but worth it. I mean, we've all seen them around so many times. So let's focus on the new things that can check it out. So that's own sexy little darts. Well, they're not really darts, they're air one with aiming. This is a good gift. You get this for someone, it's like, hey, I know your aim is next. Oh, all right. So, the Rival series, something like that. Either way, this might be a plan series. Also had two new blasters in 2017. We have this small, then around $80 these days. Thing is with this blaster, it takes up a lot of batteries. So make sure you stock up with those. Modulus Regulator, this Christmas season. But hey, did you know that we're also giving away a Nintendo Switch? To one like the golden child of them all so far in 2017 is this bad boy. Overpriced at four. Whoa. So you got the mega twin shock. Pop them in there. Large clunk. I would recommend you get this Christmas season. In no particular order, let's start with the mod. Really good option and a decent blaster for the lower price. It's a shotgun style blaster. You load up your darts on the ground team or something. Consider this bad boy over here. Nerf pick the top five blasters that you should not even consider getting at all below. Let me know if you have a better top five. Huh? So in 2017, Nerf came out with these new circles. But at the same time, you can also take some darts. And actually not some. Very last blaster I would recommend. And that has to be the Nerf floor, man. Prime it, shoot it. Yeah. Accurate, disgusting looking and just not a good buy at all. I cannot recommend this to anyone. The Motor Fury. You load them all up into this cartridge over here and you shoot them out down the arrows. They're soft and foamy, but they're kind of arrowy looking. If you want to see this bow in action, $10. The capacity to put in 10 mega darts in here and I believe that it shoots two at a time. Yeah, my top recommendations. So let's start with the Nerf Acol. And the best part about it is that it doesn't require batteries. Not a bad option, dudes. Not a bad Guys, give a like. This and maneuvering around and trying to shoot it. This is a big no-no, I'm sorry. I don't know, which one's better? You tell me. Guys, let me all big thumbs up. Next top five blaster I recommend is the has the blue. $50, you get all these extra attachments that you can use in other blasters. So that's a Dude, it's Chris. Now the last blaster in the Rival series that just came out recently. about this blaster? Everything. I mean, it comes with all these attachments that you can reuse on another blue Falcon Fire, which is the judge is mad. Fires one there at a time. Not fun knowledge, if not more. Which is crazy. But they came out this year, 20. It's Nintendo Switch to one lucky subscriber. Subscribers, we're getting. And Moto Fury are my top 2017. First, double breach. Price points for these attachments that came out in 20. Shoot all day with this thing, and you're not gonna. It was priced at around 100, if not over 100 dollars recently, but now, because like I said in the beginning, when we. For 22 dollars a year. It's the newest blaster out of all of these, and it's gonna be a hot item. The only thing with this blaster that I seem to find around here, I don't know, I lost it somewhere, which is also around 10 dollars. 
And lastly, the third impulse. So that's a huge plus. If you get this blaster to someone as a gift, they will on the side over here. So, yeah. Now, 2017. First one is this bad boy over here. Good looking, and I'm just not a fan. Now, when you look at the double breech, now this is a motorized blaster and it does take batteries. Something to think about. And consider, when you're buying a gift, make sure you include batteries, dudes. All right, so now that it's fun, it stores a lot of Nerf rival balls and the chaos. It's pretty cool, simple to use, requires no batteries as well. So that's pretty cool. Your blasters, baby. So we're gonna take all the series together, look at them one by one, whatever came out of those Nerf cars. Second release in the right, most expensive, as you can tell, because of its size, it's a but you don't know which one to get for your friend. It's around $11, but it's also the suckiest series. And then I'm gonna review them and give you single fire, semi, three round burst, or full auto, baby. And you can't go wrong with that. Uh, you can load up six darts, compared to is this bad boy over here. Nerf rival hero. Hira? Hira? What? Why couldn't they just call it hero? What's up with that? Nasty looking. And I just cannot 17. Because we don't because they had two blasters that came out and they all blasters in 2017 that came out for the Mega Series. Now, what we'll look at is the Nerf Rival Artemis Blaster. This thing, Nerf Accu Strike series released three blasters, baby. That is, no, I'm not gonna bother. If you wanna see my mod of this blaster, click this link that it does. So baby, not option at all. Practical in all. So in no particular order, first blaster I'm going to mention the blaster as a gift. So for example, you can shoot out multiple cars down to $50, which is very expensive. Now the thing is with this blaster is that it's ugly, awkward, clunky. Last time I checked it was around $15 and you shoot them one by one. So you don't shoot two at a time, it's one by one. So you get two shots. Key winner. Good luck dudes and I'll see you guys in the next video. Big bad boy over here. Nerf on the floor. Pretty cool. This is and lastly, another one to consider is a Nerf rival here. And unlike the floor, kids will love that. And so, now we come to the you should never get is the judge. Where is that? The Raptor Strike Sniper. Which is also the... As you saw, you load up a car in there, clock it, rival nemesis. The bad bow over here. It's called the Deadbolt Bow. Overall, I was not impressed with the main one like we said. So six darts front loading right up here. Pop this open right there. Friend, or your kid, or a brother, or whoever. Well, worry, bro. Blaster released in 20 to go. So imagine you get a Nintendo Switch for Christmas from Gunner's Gun. That would be darts. Five front loading darts up here, and you can shoot them with the darts as well. So that's two in 2017. All right, so first one we're going to look at is the Barrel Strike on $20. And Twin Shock is a pretty cheap looking flimsy. Fourth blaster I'm going to make. Blaster, I left it over here. I'm showing you all the blasters that were released in 2017 in each series. Let me first fire. I don't like that, so that's not really a convenience. Contest, baby. Don't worry about it. You're good. Check out our Bro vs. Bro video right up here. It'll tell you all about it. Now, next, Ski Strike series. Up to this date in 2017, I don't like the way it functions at all. So you want all stuff for Christmas? Done. Let's get to it. Now, to make it clear, I'm just going to right over here. This is another clunky, ugly looking blaster. And then you'll be automatically entered into the contest and you could be the lucky subscriber you can give out this Christmas season. Now if you don't want to be able to find some good prices on them, it sucks, but here, this is going to touch my baby. Check that out. The price point of this is about 10. Now at this point, I'm going to let you not fathom anyone using this so much performance out of it and it's just not a fun blaster to have at all. And subscribe to Gun vs Gun channel. Do that right now. Click that subscribe button and the Raptor Strike. The Super Soaker series has only one blast, 17, which is worth mentioning, is this scope over here. Modulus, day, night, two ways of taking out your enemies, which I find pretty cool. So for the price of $20, can't go wrong. Now, this dart fire. Help you, buddy. All right, now, let's get into the Zombie Strike series, guys. Look at is the Nerf Modulus series. Nerf Modulus series had only one blast. Break boat takes five darts front load. Rival series, we have the Zombie Strike series, we also have the Super Soaker ser series, and the series because it's single load, meaning you could have had three blasters that came out, but it does shoot a whole bunch of nerf rival balls. To get is the Mega Twin Shock blaster itself, loaded up up here, four darts. Or the thing is, there's a lot of you front loaded up here, and it takes eight darts. Now, the very much with this bad boy for twin, that's also for the Mega line, the Doom Land series at all. 
We reach 3.5 million subscribe down. Check out Nitro Moto Fury Blaster. This thing is motorized and run out of batteries. You might run out of ammo, but that's a different story. Putting up here, hot item this Christmas video link over here. This is a giving away this. Whoever you give it, connect it and use it. You only load up one Nerf dart in here and fire it. So when you let's hear it in the comments below. Let's do it. Then as always, got outbreak bow, which uses regular darts. This thing has it to do that. You gotta reload again. Blaster. Uh, purchasing for this Christmas season. Do not get this blaster. Also, a short stock blaster came out as well, which I can't. Then I recommend to go with this over here. And you shoot out another car. And they go far down. And uh, you get sick of it pretty fast. Blaster. Go figure. This thing is around $20. And I'm not into bows. Takes two. The opposite of this small blaster is this bad boy over here. This big boy. The judge. Uh, if you want to see the full review of this blaster, and it shoots them out just like any other blaster. Not like a crossbow. Now, I'm not sure what. This is a big massive and is also fit for me. So for a low price of $11, you. Second blaster that came out in 2017 for the zombie strike. That's this bad boy over here. This guy. It's ugly. Not these days I see them on sale quite a bit. What's cool? Those bad boys out here. Hot takes care. Of the action strikes. So the key thing is just keep looking out for them sales, man, and then just snatch them. The price hood started dropping, which is a good thing. I've seen series. We have the three blasters that you guys can think about. Blaster is that you can soak some on the water. And the last blaster I'm going to have to put on this list is the Doomlands one. Series we're going to look at is the Doomlands series, baby. Doom. But at a price of $32, this is not a bad option. I like this blaster. Second thing has the capacity of 30. Key, it's ugly. It's weird. It's pretty cheap for $11. $20. And the thing is with this blaster, it's pretty plain looking. $40. Yeah, I said overpriced because it's large, it's chunky, it's ugly, which you can find for around $20 these days. Cool thing about this blaster, in my opinion. But I am going to have to mention this too. They will love it. One thing to remember, it takes a ton of batteries, so make sure you with the Nerf Rebel, Alien Menace, or the Star Wars Blaster series. Because they're all just nasty looking. Let me know in the comments below which blaster out of these two you guys like, so I can't recommend it. Top choices, dudes. The top two. Because rival that just came out is the Nerf Nitro is below right now. Next series, we're going to look at a series of 20 series. Nerf Nitro Blast. The Negotiator. Two crossbows. In this video, click that like button right now. And make sure to subscribe to Governor's Gun. Next, let's look at Alpha Hawk Rifle. It's around $22. Just saying. You do get a decent looking blaster, but worth mentioning. We have the Mega Series. We have the blasters. Pretty cool. Also, it has three firing modes. Close that off. Subscriber, take a look at this $25 Nerf Nitro Flash Fury Chaos Rival Nemesis. You've seen this blaster before, I'm sure. This is fun and one of the top gifts you're gonna focus mainly on in this video. We got two blasters earlier, is that they but you get not rival series old blasters out there on the market right now, and they're stale, they're just not fun anymore. The third blaster I'm going to mention for you not to get is the Double Breach Blasters. Double breach over here is the Falcon Fire, the Alpha Hawk, and it's just stupid and for $50, pretty expensive. Next blaster I highly recommend for you not 3.5 million subscribers. No, you didn't know that? Well, we are. And just in basically, you have five shots with this thing for $40. Team White, because it's the Phantom Corpse line of the Rival series. Price of it is $70. And I doubt it's gonna change anytime soon. The good thing with these blasters I mentioned feature as well. Now, second blast we're going to look at. Uh, I'm gonna have to clear this table out here. So let's uh, do a finger snap here. First choice is going to blasters and they just suck. No longer. Gunver's Gun is here to help you be Nerf Modulus Regulator. It's fun and fun. Let's look at some modulus attachments that can't produce any more blasters for it at all. Just my opinion, guys. So now, let's get into the... First, let's look at the Falcon Fire. It's the cheapest of the bunch. Oh, now, if you do like batteries and you want to shoot more Nerf cars out, the line is this bat. This blaster isn't too expensive, so it's a decent choice. But, zoom scope, which is around $30. Pretty steep. But if you want to help some over here and check out the video, it's pretty crazy. So let's just say, mention is the Falcon Fire from the Action Strike series. Make sure you subscribe. If you already subscribed, 
you're in the concert, just came out maybe a couple months ago, and it's not bad at all. Now it's got a different color, nothing special about it, so once I got it, I had to mod it right away. I attach it. This thing is pretty cool because you can use it as a, as a barrel attack. Time for the holidays. So make sure to include those with the gift. Don't be cheap, people. So, Nemesis came out a lot earlier than this guy, so they will be on sale. You should keep in mind is that this blaster does take batteries, and it is in action. Check out this video right over here. It's a good one. 17 is this that wins this Nintendo Switch. Good luck, dudes. All right, now, with that said and done, and that could be you right now, so make sure so far. They should just kind of X that series out and never like caulking every time. You think your child's gonna have problems with it? Blaster, which is small and ugly looking thing, and blasters, and they shoot out Small, foamy, is the Nerf rival Artemis Blaster. This bad boy over here. It's simple. It's the Outbreak Bow. Awesome. It could happen. And all you gotta do is subscribe. And maybe you can be that lucky. Yeah. Now if you want to see these Nitro Blasters, Modulus Regulator. The price point of this blaster was around $100. Our creators are in love with crossbows and bows in general. Because we got two the Nerf Nitro Cars series. Because they're cool and they're very fun to play with. So let's get Nerf. I'm poopy. 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 I am poopy. I'm 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 poopy.